What's up? Uh, I didn't do a whole lot of recording yesterday. Well, because I kind of messed up on my tail lights. Well, at least one side. Uh, this side came out actually really, really nice. Uh, I got everything, you know, paint matched and cleared and all that good stuff. So, but on the other tail light, I'll show you my fault and I'll show you what I did wrong. Uh, what had ended up happening was I left it, I left it in too long and uh, well no I didn't I'm sorry I'll take that back I put it in on 250 240 or 250 I'm pretty sure it's 250 but and I let it sit uh, because this side was was not frying off and this plastic is so much different than um, like the headlights it's just cheap cheap plastic and I broke this side trying to just barely even pry it off so basically what you have to do is get it at that right temperature at this like right time it has to be perfect uh, and that's the tri tricky part you know this one came out actually really really nice that one didn't this one tried to part easy this one didn't so I'm gonna guess around 200 degrees to 220 for I check on it for five minutes each five minutes and that's what I did but this side was being a pain so I got everything ordered I reordered them I think they're 89 bucks so it's a mistake that you know everybody makes and life goes on but anyway the look at these things i'm so so excited they actually did a really good job on i guess painting or i don't know if it's powder paint it looks like paint really but these are the brackets for look how shiny that is for the mega cab for the mounting brackets for the uh, long arms I think what I'm going to do is leave this black and just do the long arm in powder. So, and these really didn't look that long on um, my uh, Instagram yesterday. But here's just a comparison of my house shoe. They're long. And like I said, they're, they're fully adjustable. So um, they have different lengths you can do. And they came with uh, grade eight bolts, which um, my um, whole suspension, I had changed out to grade eight anyway. So that comes out nice. I think I found a set of wheels, guys. Um, they're 2214s on a 33. Um, you know, everybody's like, go 35, man. Well, I'm not lifting it anymore. So, it's a 3 inch leveling kit on it right now. And trust me, on a 6.7 I have, I had a 35 with a 2214 with a 3 inch leveling kit. And you couldn't turn it. It was just constantly rubbing, so. 33s, 22s, plenty. Found it. They're in actually in uh, Tennessee. Uh, I think the guy is gonna meet me. It's like a 45 minute drive. I think an hour maybe. Um, I might either do it today or tomorrow. I don't know. Uh, mirrors will be in here today. I don't know when I'm gonna get to them. I'll be paint matching them. I gotta get my paint room heated up. So we'll be doing that uh, here in, after a while. Hopefully the wheels. I'm trying to get this thing done. This is like, I'm usually three days, maybe a week, maybe two. Um, I think I've had this truck two and a half weeks, maybe three. 
I'm gonna try to, I mean, after the wheels and the mirrors, I mean, it, it's pretty much done. And then, I, like I said, I gotta do the tail light. And um, so, yeah, we'll go from there. Just got the uh, the mirrors taken off the floor, and finally got her cleaned up. So that's all taken off. Just waiting on the mirrors right now. Get all that done. Mirrors and the powder coating, or the powder coat rather. Sorry, but the candy tail should be here. It says it's in Glasgow ready to be shipped so we'll see so we just got to uh, check the mail um, got the uh, the powder coat in and also we have the uh, newer model mirror mirrors so I will go ahead and start when I get back to the shop start taping everything up and um, Start paint matching. Um, get the first or second coat of base coat on the mirrors. So yeah, that's the little jug I was talking about with paint. Um, Pretty warm in here, I got the oven going on, so getting ready to lay some clear down and see what we can do, see what they look like. Alright, so we just got the uh, Ford done, got the mirrors all paint matched up, so looking good, looking good. I would sit around and chit chat, but I have got to go to Bowling Green and meet my dad, so we can go Christmas shopping. And I've still got to run my stuff off to get powder coat, powder coat and stuff. And then I dropped two 12 millimeter nuts in my door panel. And um, yeah, so I gotta go to Lowe's later or Harbor Freight or something while I'm in Bone Grant and get those. Probably need four of them. I am on the way to Bowling Green right now. I go Christmas shopping, uh, get back, finish putting the mirror on, and hopefully this guy takes me by some damn wheels. Shit. Well, just got to Bowling Green. It's only about 30 minutes from my house, so. Yeah. A lot of traffic pretty annoyed everybody's texting and driving so I'm gonna wait on dad um, give me something to eat and yeah all right we just got uh, the uh, long arms all dropped off at this place uh, my good friend Sean aka Birdman he's the man if I ever have anything uh, that needs to be powder coated. Well, bigger stuff. Sorry, I'm out of breath. Those uh, four links are a little heavy, so. I'm glad I did this, dang. <laughs> My powder is right there. All right, take two. Powder's dropped off. Whew. I'm out of breath. Still in Bone Green, about to head back, wrap some presents. Uh, just got out of the mall. What a disaster. Ugh, I'm over it. Uh, about to get on the interstate. And I'm trying to get the hell home before it gets completely dark. I've got fog lights, the LEDs, but if you've got a tinted windshield and. Uh, uh, they're not very bright, so I'm gonna try to get home for it. Completely goes dark, so yep.